Zero is the, the pointy end of the spear in terms of the, the tech, New Zealand tech story. I started up the company a few years ago and it's now taken into being a multi-billion dollar company listed on the New Zealand yeah. stock market. And I've got some fantastic backing. Uh, a lot of money coming in behind them. At the moment, they've got about 200 job opportunities going, um, and in the next couple of years, we'll definitely have more opportunities available as they just grow and get bigger and bigger. The really great thing about Zero is that there have been a lot of other startup companies that have uh, developed as a result of their development, developing plug-in apps that work with their uh, accounting solution. We've, we've always been very vocal about our support for the local IT community, wanting to do things for the IT community there, not only attract people to work at Zero, but being very involved in various events. And so, so South By is kind of a, a good opportunity for us to promote New Zealand as a great destination to come and work, but also, you know, obviously to, to pimp what Zero is about as well and to get the message out. Heaps you know, of people have already heard of not only New Zealand but what Zero is doing, so you know, both Zero and the New Zealand uh, image are out there pretty strongly already. And I think we can do more than that, you know, more, we tend to do that in isolation. We pimp our tourists, it's the beauty of the country, uh, and we, we do some work in telling people to come here and work here, it's a beautiful place. But, Companies, I think, can be more responsible about sort of going out there and say, "Hey, you know, we're, we're doing some great work in the world. Uh, we're, we're thinking about it. You know, responsible employer, and you can work with New Zealand, and you can work on cool tech. You can mix that all up. It's nice that South by is, is attracting people who are naturally have that sort of sense. So it's great to, I think, do that more in Wellington and New Zealand as a whole. Certainly here, and the focus, I think, from a New Zealand point of view, is tech talent. So people who are either engineers, so building software, web developers, front-end developers, uh, test engineers, test analysts, uh, business analysts even. We don't have enough of a pool of resources to find the right people that we need. So bringing in talent from outside is the only way we can scale. The only way we can scale. It's never been in the life of the company an issue of uh, being able to afford talent. It's about finding the right talent that we want to bring on board from a cultural alignment point of view and a skill set point of view and, and bringing them in. And we just can't fulfill that with local talent only, unfortunately. I like the fact that uh, there, are, there are people here that are inspiring me to think about different ways of building a culture in, in Zero, keeping that culture, defining it or not defining it, uh, thinking about uh, the sort of the core values that we have as a company that will translate into attracting people to work for us because their, their, their sort of values will align to that. And I think that you know, that is really important to every now and then check on. I think we do a really good job with it, uh, but it's really nice to come here and talk to other people who are working for businesses and companies who have ideas about how they've kept the energy and the you know, dynamic nature of their business going through just thinking about some of these things. So yeah, really interesting people I talked to throughout the whole few days that I've been here.